I mean, she was one of those dream children who never gave you a problem. She never swam against the tide. She still, nonetheless, had a very strong personality. Um, she was everybody's friend, immensely popular. Sarah Groves was just 24 when she was murdered in India. She had been stabbed more than 40 times. For her family, four long years of unbelievable pain have followed. Today, her father, Vic Groves, told me he wants the Foreign Office to step in after what he called the appalling and chaotic handling of their case. The man accused of Sarah's murder, Dutchman Richard DeWitt, now faces his 88th court appearance, while her family are still no closer to answers. I want the British government to tell or liaise with or have a dialogue in some form with the Indian government to say, can you not put this onto a proper playing field, footing where it has the respect it deserves? And that's all we want. In April 2013, Sarah had been sleeping on a houseboat owned by her Indian boyfriend's family when she was murdered. Richard DeWitt, who has a history of suffering from paranoia, was also a guest on board but denies killing her. Sarah's family have even met the man accused of murdering their daughter after the judge gave them permission. When you talk to him, you're, um, you're raising that question at the back of your mind all the time. Is this the guy who savagely, brutally stabbed my daughter 42 times? Um, uh, it does seem when you start to talk to him, that is not something that he's capable of. Very Whatever the outcome, Sarah's father told me, he just wants the truth and justice for the daughter he called so popular. In her dad's words, Sarah was universally adored by all.